There's a new World Health Organization review on saturated and trans fats and chronic disease risk. And since I think we can all agree that trans fats aren't good for us, I'm just going to focus on the saturated fat findings. They reviewed 112 publications regarding prospective studies on saturated fat consumption, including over 3.5 million participants in total. Their results suggest that replacing 5% of one's total calories from saturated fat with either total polyunsaturated fats or the omega-6 fat linoleic acid specifically could reduce the risk of coronary heart disease by 11%. Similarly, replacing the saturated fat with plant-based monounsaturated fats or slow-digesting carbohydrates could reduce the risk by 17% and 6% respectively. On the other hand, replacing 5% of calories from saturated fat with animal protein was associated with 31% higher risk. Of note, this isn't considering the specific sources of each macronutrient, and I would suspect differences depending on the source, so keep that in mind. For all-cause mortality, which is the total risk of death during a study, replacing 5% of calories from saturated fat with either polyunsaturated fat or plant-based monounsaturated fat was associated with a 15% lower risk. And replacing saturated fat with carbohydrates was associated with an 8% lower risk, even though they lumped all carbohydrates together in that analysis. They also evaluated the risk of consuming more than 10% of calories from saturated fat, which is the limit recommended by the USDA. And those consuming more had a 9% higher risk of mortality compared to those consuming less.